guys, so y'all love our Who Wore It Better videos so much. Of course, we're doing another one, and this time we are calling it Who Wore It Better Ugly Clothes. We've got four ugly items that our team picked out. I haven't even seen them yet, but we're supposed to style them and try to make them look cute. And so this time when we post the Instagram story, we are actually not going to show faces. So that way it's not biased. You people think it's biased? It's then? solely off of clothes. They look, this isn't me. This is coming from the comments on the last Who Wore It Better video. Okay. So we're gonna do that and see it. how it goes. Oh boy. These look interesting. Oh boy. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Oh. Oh, actually, I actually kind of think oh, that's kind of cute. I'm just joking. Cute. Joking. That's cute. That's cute. When the team tries to be ugly, but and it's actually cute. They always get mad at us because we style it and then they're like, what the heck? It looks so good. That is going to be so easy to make look that cute. That is going to be really easy. Oh. 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 Okay, but who? Oh who my! <gasps> is that a blanket? No. How are you supposed to style that? <laughs> Go. Good job. Look at the good fly. I just think. Fly away. I'm out of a blanket. Fly. I truly think it would. I truly. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder if we're actually 20, honestly. Okay, so since this one is a jumper, it's kind of already like an outfit. So there doesn't need to be much to go with it. I'm just gonna put a belt with it. I got this belt here. You can see all the details. And kind of put it around the waist to cinch it a little bit and then tie up the jumper and we'll see how it looks. Since we're cutting off her head, there isn't much you can do styling wise from the <laughs> neck up. So like any hats and stuff aren't really an option. So it's mostly either shoes and accessories for this one specifically because it is a jumper, so I'm gonna go add the belt and see how it looks. I quickly realized that um, this one is a little far cut on the side, so I'm gonna have to put a tank top on underneath. I will be adding that. Unfortunately, I will not be showing you the cut because it's a little too much skin, but just trust me on that and I will show you with a tank top. This is this is supposed to be where the uh, crotch area is and it's straight up at my knees. Like, I'm not even kidding you when I say at my knees. This is very typical for me because I am so short, 5'1", gotta love it. All shout out to my short girls. And so I'm pretty accustomed to having jumpers that are super oversized. So I'm gonna add the belt and show you. Ta-da! So with the belt added, it's completely transformed the jumper. So it's less like a balloon and more fitted. <laughs> my butt looks so voluminous right now. <laughs> what is happening? Why does my butt look like that? Either go bare. I kinda am digging the barefoot look. It makes it feel a little more hippie-ish. So this might be it for me. So my original idea was to get like a bright blue like sports bra and just wear it underneath. Then I realized that I don't own one. So I did however find this like really cute tannish green color. So I think I'm gonna put that underneath. This is what it look, it's so cute. I want like the high neck. I want this style underneath it. But this is the wrong color. This is like a, I don't know if you can see it. This is like a green and not a tan like I thought it was gonna be more like. The green doesn't really look good. So I'm gonna have to go on the hunt for something similar to this but in a color that might match a little bit better. I found the blue shirt, which is great. And now I'm gonna just put this necklace on and kind of going for more of like an Aladdin vibe because this kind of gives me those like same patterns from like the movie and stuff. So I'm gonna put this on and call it an outfit. I wonder who's gonna win. <laughs> outfit we'll number start. one. And we're not going to take pictures with our faces. No faces, so it will look like this. As you guys know, since we have three more things to style, we will post the stories after we're done with all that. So this is number one, on to number two. Hmm. Good luck. Yep. Literally, how? I think I can probably tuck the skirt into some pants and make the top just look like a tank top. No, no. Excuse me, ma'am? Styling. Okay, so I'm currently trying to tuck it in while holding these pants up. I borrowed them from Camry because number one, I'm in Dallas and not in Waco, so I actually don't even have my closet here. I'm moving out of a suitcase. Number two, I didn't have any jeans with me, so I had to borrow some from Camry. And number three, they're a little bit bigger, so that way hopefully you don't see the bumps from this. But I'm like struggling to tuck it in and keep my pants up at the same time. So yeah, here we go. Gonna start tucking it in and see how this goes. Okay. Trying to like pull out the, okay. 
Okay. Aha! Okay! Yes! Yes! And now I can kind of wear like a tank top-ish kind of style. In case anyone was wondering, yes, you can tuck a dress into the legs and no one's gonna know. So I think I'm good. I think I'm done. Not only is it very large, but it's also very long. This might be the first time I truly don't know what to do. I'm gonna go upstairs and hopefully find something to give me inspiration, but I'm gonna be honest. Um, I'm pro I think I'm gonna lose on this one, I, I really do. Okay, so after a trial period of going out and complaining to my mom about how hard this was to style, which was not cheating because she didn't give me any advice, I styled it with a denim shirt and I like tied it. So what I did is I took a belt and I wrapped it super tight around and then I pulled the top up so the skirt was shorter. I still think on this one I might not win just because this skirt is like not traditional and I don't think people are gonna like this as a skirt as much as they're gonna like it as a top. But I did my best considering I had to follow Bailey's act and I was put at a disadvantage. So, ta -da! Outfit oh, number two. This one was freaking hard. If you actually cut the skirt off of this, that might be kind of cute crop top. It, it probably would, would be, be if know. you could cut the skirt off. But yeah, again, we'll take the pictures and post them when we're done. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, so you can obviously see I have one pant leg and one shorts leg. I managed to tie up the little flare thing so that it looked more like a ruched biker short, kind of. And I think my best bet with this is just to try and go with a biker short look because I honestly have no other idea what to do. So I'm gonna tuck the other side. I'll show y'all how I did it. So I basically just folded this part up and then folded it down like this and then took the back part and twisted it and then tucked it in so it would stay. And then I like roosted this part up so it looked all. And I, I tucked my tank top already too, so it's already a crop, made into a crop top. I think, I, I, I don't know what else to do with this. I don't know what else to do with this, so I'm just gonna call it a day and say that that's that for me. <laughs> what tank top and biker short look it is for me, I guess. You know, while the tight flare pant look isn't for me, maybe someone out there likes it. I think I'm just gonna leave them as they are. Not what I would consider my favorite look, you know? It's got the, the like reptile-y, rainbow-y vibe going on here, you know? It just, it just, yeah. I'm gonna look at a few other options, but I don't know if it gets it gonna get any better than this. Okay, so not my favorite outfit in the world, but I found this like loose purpley sweater um, and I put it on with these pants. Now, I realized that these pants don't really have like a light purple in them. They have kind of a dark purple. I kind of give up. I, th I think this is good as it's gonna get. I thought the crop looked good, but I like it better with the sweater. Kind of gives me a Little Mermaid vibes. I think this is what I'm gonna stick with. Ta-da! Ta -da! Outfits, not my favorite at all. Probably would never Probably choose I to hide I hate the pants. fact that I look like I literally have a camel toe every time my legs even come slightly together. <laughs> okay, so again, we'll take pictures and post them at the end. The blanket. What? Okay, I straight up feel like I'm putting on a blanket right now. <laughs> I have an idea for this one. I think I can take these sides and tie them. No! Ah hey guys, do you like my new dress? This is honestly the best way to do it though. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, so this thing is straight up just a bed sheet. I'm going to try some aquamarine mojo up in here. I'm gonna try to do the rappy strappy thingy that she does in them. You know what I'm talking about. You know, you know what scene I'm talking about. And when she does the rappies and then all of a sudden she's in this dress that she made out of a shirt. So I'm gonna try that with this and see how it goes. 
So seriously, after like in the back, so you know. 10 seconds of tying it, I got to this. So it's a little poochie with a little knot and off the shoulder. But essentially what I did was I didn't actually put the dress on, I just held it up. And then I took the long parts and I like wrapped it around my body and tied the knot. And then I used the sleeves. You can see here, I didn't even put the sleeves actually on. I used the head hold to my arms through the armholes and it made it super tight. So I'm gonna take my sports bra off and then I will be done. So, so these are our dresses <laughs> that we made from the brown sheet. Yeah. Um, I keep walking around like this because I'm afraid the knot's gonna fall Mine's out. Mine's cinched in there. I'm not going anywhere. So let's take some photos and you guys can judge who did better. We just posted them. Don't, we're not gonna, like, we can't tell what the percentages are gonna be yet because- What? Yeah, I, I totally thought yours was gonna win. I'm mad about that one, cause she covered up her knot in that photo, which the knot made it less cute. And so it's you, not fair. We strategically take pictures for a reason. Not fair. Oh, you're winning this one. For right now. Not going down, there we go. I, we we predicted that, that one. That one. Oh! <laughs> right side, that's me! Okay. Right is right me. Right is you. Left is me. Ooh, left, left is Bailey. <laughs> yes! Finally! She finally won when she felt like she deserved it. Congratulations. Finally. It's Do a, a happy time. dance. Wow. Thank you. Thank you.